Hello, this is for third grade. Um, today we're doing lesson three, and we'll start by comparing numbers by using the symbols greater than, less than, or equal to. So, number one, we have four thousand four hundred sixty-two thousand three hundred and eighty-nine. Um, compared to seven hundred thirty-nine thousand one hundred twenty-eight. So, um, let's look at the the largest di the largest place digits four and seven seven is greater so it's a less than sign number two we have one hundred forty nine thousand one hundred seventy seven to um one hundred forty nine thousand and five hundred and uh, and five sorry one hundred forty nine thousand fifty three so the first three digits are the same so but then when we look at the hundreds place, um, this side is bigger, so it's a greater than sign. Number three, we have um, these blocks, and so here we'll count 100, 100, 200, and then four tens, so this is 240. And this side we have 100, 10, 100, 10, and 3, 113. So it's greater than. And number 4 is the same. Number 5, we have 420 plus 121. Let's add that first. And we get 541. So... 541 to 749 and 70, 749 is greater so it's 549 41 is less than 749 um okay mm, number six let's just do number six so 80 plus 400 is 480 and 100 plus 280 is 480 Oh, they're equal, so we're gonna do equal sign. Um, next, define whether the number is odd or even. So, um, it's odd when the ones place or the very last place is um is an odd number. So, like, even if let's say it was like eighty three, um, even if um the tens place is even if this place is odd then the whole thing is odd so um it's zero two four six eight is all even and one three five seven nine are all odd so this one is odd and then um, number six, we have 3006, so it ends with six, which is even, so this is even. Mm, let's do one more. Number nine, 904 ends with four, which is even, so it's even. Next, use standard form to write each number. Number one, um, so 5,000 plus 300 plus 8, so 5,308. Um, one more, number 3, 1,720. Mm, and then number 5 is different, 400 is 3 tenths, so that's 430. Number six, seven hundred, six tens, and seven ones, seven hundred sixty-seven. Uh, last one, number ten, eight hundred ten, it's eight hundred ten. Okay, next word problems. Matthew lives in a town with a population of fourteen thousand four hundred twenty-two. Last year, there were 300 and, 
with 3,150 fewer people living in the town. How many people lived in the town last year? So, mm, that means we'll do 4,422 people, the amount of people living right now, minus 3,100, 3, sorry, yeah, 3,150, um, subtract it to find, um, last year's amount, so it's, um, okay, 2 minus 0, 2, 2 minus 5, and turn it into 12, oops, then 7, 3 minus 1 is 2, 4 minus 3 is 1, 1, so, um, 11,272 people, that's short for people, PPL. <laughs> Number two, Alex lives in a city with a population of 30,812. Sonia lives in a city with a population of 30,847. Whose city has more population? So, if you look at the, um, the place digits, the first three numbers are the same. But the tens place, Sonia has the bigger number. It's um, she has four in her tens place, while Alex has one. So Sonia's city has more. Sonia's number three. Brayden bought two cakes and eight cookies. Anna bought six cakes and five cookies. Who bought more food? Brayden is two cakes plus eight. Two plus eight equals twelve. Uh, ten. Sorry. Um, Anna bought six cakes plus five cookies, which is 11. So Anna bought more food. Okay. Yeah. Um, number four, Elias uses 7,200s, four tens, and seven ones to not model a number. What number did she um, model? So 7,247. That's the answer. Thank you for watching.